The F100 research vehicle celebrated its world premiere 25 years ago. Never before had the designers and engineers realized so many new ideas and innovative solutions in a single vehicle. In January 1991, Mercedes-Benz unveiled the research vehicle at the NAIS show in Detroit, thereby establishing an especially exclusive family of models. The F100 was the first Mercedes-Benz research vehicle to feature an F in its name. In 1991, the F100 was clearly a member of the group of visionary research vehicles. It was employed by the engineers and designers to implement key findings in relation to future demands on vehicle technology. Among other things, the research vehicle incorporated findings from accident social research. The occupants in the second row were seated to the left and right behind the driver. Two further passengers were given seats towards the center between the sturdy rear wheel houses. The innovative spatial concept of the interior was matched by new type doors, access to the driver's seat was by means of rotating swiveling doors, which took parts of the vehicle floor and roof with them when opened. When they were closed, mechanical locking mechanisms in three places ensured firm, reliable closing. With many of its systems, the F100 anticipated solutions that were in future years to give rise to the connected car. These included the voice-controlled telephone system and the central display, on which the vehicle system automatically showed the key information in every situation, such as the current speed or warnings about traffic in the area around the vehicle. Other electronic assistance systems in the F100 included access to the car by chip card instead of a conventional key, electric motors to control the adjustment of seat and steering wheel, mobile fax and a permanently installed personal computer. The research vehicle also adopted a new approach to lighting technology. The highly compact headlamps were the first from Mercedes-Benz to use as discharge lamps. This technology was later to become known under the name of Xenon Headlamps. Another first from Mercedes-Benz was the front-wheel drive of the F100. The engineers experimented with various engine concepts in the research vehicle, including a modified internal combustion engine that ran on hydrogen. In the sum of its features and design details, the F100 represented nothing less than a new type of automobile. Today, 25 years after its premiere, the philosophy behind this research vehicle is more up-to-date than ever. This channel all bends. Thank you for attention. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel.